Welcome to the Rich Club channel. Before viewing, please like the video, write a comment and subscribe to the channel. Thanks, let's go! Tesla has already done a lot of work on updating its Model S and Model X passenger flagships, but these are just a couple of similar planned new products for this year. Much more significant events are the launch of the electric semi-truck and the Cybertruck pickup truck. And judging by the way events are developing, the first on the convoyer will be semi-truck. One of the users managed to capture on video its pre-production copy. Be sure to watch the video to the end to learn about the unaccepted update of the truck from Musk. Now we will learn about the truck from the company Tesla. In the summer of 2016, Tesla Motors announced the release of an electric truck and the officially the model called Semi was presented to the public in November 2017. The novelty received a futuristic exterior design, while there is not a single sharp line in the design of its cabin. The car also lacks traditional side mirrors. As a result, the drug coefficient of the Tesla Semi was 0.36, which is even better than that of the Bugatti Chiron, which is 0.38. The driver's seat of the truck is located right in the center of the cabin. To the left and right of the steering wheel are two large touchscreen displays that display images from side view cameras, navigation maps and other necessary information. In addition, the performance of the engines is sufficient for the truck to move at a constant speed of 105 km per hour during a 5 degree climb. The claimed range of the Tesla Semi is 805 km, while charging the batteries is proposed to be carried out from high-speed charging stations that will appear in the coming years along the main roads of the United States. After 30 minutes of staying at such station, the truck will be able to travel another 640 km. Of course, the Tesla Semi was equipped with an autonomous control system, the functionality of which, among other things, allows several such cars to get together in a convoy independently following each other. Mass production of the electric truck is planned for 2021 but you can place a pre-order for the purchase of the truck now. Just a month after the presentation of the truck, Tesla received more than 400 orders for it. The largest customer for December 2017 was the American delivery service UPS, which has made an advance payment for 125 trucks, and PepsiCo plans to purchase another 100. Before that, 40 trucks were ordered by a producer of a Budweiser beer. The head of Tesla, Elon Musk, revealed the power reserve of the semi-electric truck. According to him, the model will be able to travel almost 1000 km or 621 miles without recharging. To achieve this, new Tesla technologies in the field of rechargeable batteries will allow, according to Electrek with reference to Musk. Zeus, the yet-to-be-released Tesla semi-truck will be able to drive on a single charge no less than Mercedes-Benz Gen H2 gasoline truck introduced in September. Now you will find out how much a new truck from Tesla company will cost. Earlier, Tesla announced other data. At the premiere of the semi-prototype in 2017, Musk stated that production truck in the base standard will have a power reserve of 300 miles or 483 kilometers, and in the top-end long-range version, 500 miles or 805 kilometers. At the same time, he also named the preliminary cost of the versions $150,000 and $180,000 respectively. Prepayment for each truck is $20,000, while those who want to buy a truck in the Founder Series special version will immediately have to pay 100% prepayment of $200,000 for it. Now you will learn about the unaccepted update of the truck. However, during a recent interview, Musk announced an increase of the power reserve of the electric truck. According to him, during the test of Semi, the engineers came to the conclusion that this can be achieved before the release of the model to the market. To get a power reserve of 500 km, in my opinion, is quite easy, even if the truck pulls a load weighing 40 tons. For really long-distance transportation, we are going to increase the range to 800 
and even 1000 kilometers, Musk said. It is accepted that the Tesla Semi will be equipped with a four-engine electric power plant and autopilot. From a standstill to 100 km per hour, the truck will be able to accelerate in 5 seconds and with a 40-ton trailer in 20 seconds. The assembly of the electric truck was planned to be launched last year, but the release of the model was postponed first to 2020 and then to 2021. Now you will find out where Tesla will make its trucks. Elon Musk noted that the company Tesla has decided on the place where the electric truck Tesla Semi will be put into mass production. During a conference call on Tesla's financial results for the second quarter of 2020, the company's CEO said the mass production of the Tesla Semi will begin at the new Tesla Gigafactory in Texas. We are going to build a large factory here, and there we will also produce Cybertruck, Tesla Semi, and will produce electric cars, Model 3 and Model Y, for the eastern half of North America," said Elon Musk. This was the first official confirmation of Tesla's plans to place the production of Tesla Semi in Texas. During the presentation of Tesla Semi in 2017, the automaker said that the electric truck will appear on the market in 2019, but then the timing was postponed to the end of 2020 and it was only about small production volumes. After that, the schedule was adjusted again, postponing the start of production of the Tesla Semi for 2021. But Musk recently told employees in an email that it's time to bring the Tesla Semi into mass production. Now you will learn about another small update. Initially, Tesla planned to launch mass production of the Semi mainline electric truck in 2019, but now it will be launched no earlier than this year. At a recent quarterly conference, Elon Musk explained that the main deterrent is the lack of traction batteries. This does not prevent Tesla from creating new semi-prototypes. A new prototype truck was seen by eyewitnesses on the road near the California city of Sacramento, as noted by the kilowatts. The truck moved along the road not independently but on the platform of another truck, but this does not mean that it is technically deprived of such a possibility. Experts say that over the past three years since the formal announcement, Tesla has created at least two semi-prototypes and this is already the third in a row, and it has minor differences in design. The rear photo shows that the tail of the rear part of the cabin only simulates the habitable compartment of the truck. In fact, it covers the empty space that begins behind the single roof cabin with a fairing roof. In the production version, it is assumed that the cabin will be more spacious to provide a place for the driver to rest and sleep. On the other hand, even in the most long-range version, the Semi will be able to travel no more than 1000 km on a single charge, and a professional driver can cover this distance in one shift. There will be no urgent need to spend the night in the cabin if the road will run through the area of developed infrastructure. Would you like to see such trucks in the city? And do you think that the electric trucks are the future? Write your opinion in the comments. Thank you for watching, put your thumbs up, and if you haven't subscribed yet, then subscribe now. In the following videos, there will be a lot of interesting things. See you soon.